This is the Old Guy Network. Yep. Welcome back to the Old Guy Network. All is good in the trailer hood, as I always say. Well, we've got more unboxings for you, and today, no exception. This is going to be uh, an unboxing for a camera that I ordered, a webcam, uh, very similar to the one I already have, but uh, I wanted to see how the really inexpensive cameras uh, operated. So it's, uh, yeah, it's going to be a mystery, and here it is right here. I actually ordered this off eBay, uh, got here in about four days, so not bad, not bad at all. So let's get right into it. And I'll be able to uh, test this out, and we'll be able to compare between the cameras I already have and this camera. All right. Webcam, full HD, 1080p. <laughs> I thought full HD was 4K or something. I don't know. Anyway, this is high definition. It is high definition. Not ultra high definition like my other camera has the ability to be, but uh, that's it. They put it in the, you know, comes in this little box and they put it in a nice padded envelope and uh, there shouldn't be any problems with that. That's the user guide right there. And, well, what do you expect? I mean, I think I paid... $17 for this? Something like that? I don't know. What, what's on here? $17.91 was the total order on this. So, you know, let's see how good it is. Sometimes you get lucky with the, the cheaper stuff, and it works, you know, fairly well. Okay, well, it's got a couple of features that I kind of like. First of all, it's got a mount right on it that has this which means I can hook that right up to a standard tripod. That would be kind of nice. So we got that. Plus, I've got some lighting stands that uh, have the same uh, connection, same screw type. So I should be able to, to put that on there. Look at that. It even flips around. It goes this way and this way. So, hey, that's pretty good. And has this little privacy cover. So if you're a little paranoid and you think people are, you know, looking at you through your camera while the uh, computer is off, hey, just close that right down like that. You don't have to use duct tape anymore. So that's kind of nice. All right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little break from this video, shut the computer down, plug this in, and uh, see how easy it is to set up. And I'll, uh, I'll compare this camera with my Logitech camera that I paid a lot more money for. And uh, we'll see how that works. So, yeah. Well, okay. Uh, I've uh, I've hooked up the camera. I hooked it right up to the uh, computer without shutting it off, and it looked terrible. So then I shut off the computer just to make sure that you know the software did what it's supposed to do. And uh, yeah, it uh, it still looks terrible. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, and this is as far away as I can get. If you notice, the cameras are right side by side. That's my standard camera that, I, that I've had before, and uh, this is the new camera, which was supposed to be self-focusing. It is not. Um, it's supposed to be high definition. It is not. <laughs> but it was $17, so almost $18. Will I use this camera? Sure. I will use this probably for the, the squirrel house or, or something, or, or just have a, just a general broad sh camera shot in the uh, in the shed something like that yeah I'll use it for that uh, would I use it to broadcast most of the time no no I, I would not I mean this this one's a heck of a lot better this was a, an expensive Logitech camera not real expensive but you know moderately so um, <laughs> this comes with absolutely no uh, mention of who makes it, where it's made, um, no idea. Um, like I said, I bought it on eBay, and uh, I paid seventeen dollars and ninety-one cents, whatever it was, uh, which was probably too much. But l what do you expect for under twenty bucks? I mean, that I got an image, that's pretty good. Yeah, you know, that's that's okay. Uh, like I said, I'll put this in the uh, in the shed. Uh, I'll put it up in the corner probably so we can show a. 
you know a, a nice broad view and uh, maybe I can play around with the settings uh, this thing really needs to be white balanced and there's no way to white balance it uh, the lens is terrible it's it, <laughs> the whole thing is 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 awful but it has a nice mount <laughs> and it's got this little privacy thing right here look at that and we can open that back up and yeah no this is this is pretty bad so let's go back to the original there we go that's the one that uh, does a, a much better job I even tried changing the frame rate and everything else on it and uh, no it's uh, it's terrible <laughs> I kind of expected it to be terrible but you never know once in a while you know you buy something that's uh, pretty cheap and it works fairly well so this is not one of those things and it's too bad because I really do like the little mount that, that it has on there. I wish mine had that. Mine doesn't have that. I wish it did. But I guess they're both mine now. So, yeah, this is uh, this is pretty horrible. <laughs> so that's my unboxing of a cheap webcam. And uh, I guess the question to ask is, did I get screwed on this? Well, not really. I mean, I, I knew it wasn't going to be the best quality in the world. It is... You know, it is what it is. It's a $20 webcam. And that's, uh, you know, you get what you pay for, right? Isn't that what they always say? Look at that. I forgot to turn my light on before. There's there's my light. Got another light over here, too. These are the ones that I uh, did an unboxing for last week. And uh, those work pretty well. And I got those fairly cheap. Those were under $20. So I'd rather have the lights for $20 then get another one of these cameras. So that's it for this unboxing. Uh, it is what it is. Don't waste your money on, on cheap cameras as far as I'm concerned. You know, uh, it's if, if you want something nice, you got to pay for it. And the one I got is pretty good. Self-focusing, it is a high definition. I can go up to 4K with it if I want to. And, uh, you know, I'll, I'll get another one exactly like this to do uh, more, more stuff uh, later on. But... Uh, no more of the cheap cameras. We're done with that. So that's going to do it for this edition of Unboxing a Crappy Camera. <laughs> I'm the old guy. I'm the OG. And I'm out.